Hello Virgo, welcome to another love reading. We're going to be looking at past, present, and future energies regarding love and a little bit more on the energies between you and this particular person that you're dealing with. So let's jump right in for Virgo. Spirit, angels, for Virgo regarding love. Okay, the past energy we have the Knight of Wands, present energy, the Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and then the near future energy, the High Priestess. Overall, okay, before I look at the overall energy, I forgot to put down your energies down here first. Knight of Swords and the Eight of Pentacles on your end, Five of Wands, and the Hermit, there you are, Virgo, on their end. And then overall energy at the bottom of the deck is the Page of Wands. A lot of fire energy here. It's like someone wants to make a move, wants to move quickly, is attracted to something new. It could be a new cycle, a new beginning, because the world is here. Let's see. Can we get some more insight, please, on the energies for Virgo? Can we get some insight, please, on the energies for Virgo? Virgo, I think there's also something here in terms of like a message that you might be waiting on or sending with this Knight of Swords. Your person has the Five of Wands though with the Hermit. So maybe there were there was an argument or some sort of difficulty between you and this other person that I feel pushed you away. What are the energies for Virgo and love? Pure seduction, lust, Temptation, desire, you're being tempted to give in to your desires, patiently waiting. What you desire will be given at the right time, have faith. And wow, coming together, destiny has brought you together. So when I see all of these energies together, I think that someone is attracted to a specific person. There's chemistry, there's um, sparks, you know, the sparks are flying. Um, and it's like you're being drawn together or, or brought together. You know, you just had to wait for them a little bit. Let me bring this down a little bit more so you can see. Hmm. This is very interesting because I feel like that's probably why all this fire is here. And I'm like, why is there so much fire in this reading? So let's get down to the nitty gritty. Page of Wands is the overall energy, so this is why things are happening. Someone's taking the initiative. Someone's being bold. Someone's attracted to something. And the Nine of Wands tells me that this has been also like a recent occurrence, something that's from the past, that has happened in the past. I feel like you've met someone or are dealing with someone um, where, you know, there's an attraction or things have been moving quickly. Maybe there's passion. Why is this page of wands here? Or someone's doing something, taking action. Why is the page of wands here? Ace of swords. Ten of swords. Why is the page of wands here? Maybe that's why the world was there. The Hierophant. Taurus energy. Maybe a commitment ended. Maybe one of you left a partnership, a commitment, others of you could have been dealing with a person who had some sort of change in their life and is not able to come towards you or vice versa. You've had some change in your life that's allowing you to have an ending. I think someone's wanting to talk to you about this and I'm having a hard time speaking right now or staying focused. I feel like whatever this is, it might have happened quickly, you know, maybe someone like jumped the gun <laughs> i'm trying to figure out how this affects you though tell me about the knight of wands why is the knight of wands here the empress why is the knight of wands here
two of cups, knight of cups, and then there's the hermit. There you are. I feel like, yeah, it's like someone's interested in you, you're interested in someone else, and there's like the potential for something new to begin. I feel like someone, um, yeah, they see success with you, they recognize you, they notice you, and this happened in the recent past. Or this is like happening, you know, in the near future here, and then setting all of this in motion. Tell me about the Queen of Wands. This is like the present energy. Queen of Wands is very bold. What she wants, she typically gets. Tell me about the Queen of Wands. Okay, I keep getting a bunch of cards. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles. Temperance, Sagittarius energy, and the Sun. Whatever you've waited for, Virgo, this is it's, it's almost like you're what you waited for is here. You're going to be able to have what you've wanted, what you've desired. It makes you very happy. This is good news. This offer is, you know, happily accepted. <laughs> and it probably came at the right time. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. I feel like you caught someone's eye and they're making a move on you. They're making moves towards you, this person. So why the High Priestess in the near future? Why is the High Priestess here? Why is the High Priestess here? She's all about secrets, intuition, what's hidden. Ten of Cups. Okay, tell me about the High Priestess. Wow, the Fool. Tell me more about this High Priestess energy. Yeah, all of you, for the Virgo that I'm reading for, you're headed towards something new. Something that makes you very happy. Oh, but the Five of Wands. Okay, what I'm getting here, I'm getting two messages right away. Number one, the first message I'm getting is, you want to keep this quiet. This could be a job offer for some of you. You want to keep this quiet to avoid trouble. Maybe there's people that are jealous or wouldn't react well to the fact that you got this offer. Yeah, I see you holding on to this offer, this new start, you know, not really telling anybody your plans. Some of you, this is definitely related to work. For some reason, you don't want to tell people that you got a promotion or you got a new offer because it's going to cause problems for you in some way. Okay, tell me about this Knight of Swords and the Eight of Pentacles. Why is the Knight of Swords here? With the Eight of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles. You're, eva you're evaluating this offer that's coming in. Maybe you're going um, asking questions, going back and forth. Yeah, this is something you wanted, the Magician. This is something you worked for. Yeah, you waited for this. You've been waiting for this and it's like here. This, this opportunity is here. I sense that some of you also, it's almost like once this offer comes in, you're going to be super busy getting things ready. So I still feel like for most of you, this could be a job offer, a career opportunity. And for some reason, it's bringing you together with a soulmate or a partner with this coming together. Um, others of you, this could be that someone wants to move in together. Someone wants to take that next step in your connection. Someone wants to... Um, commit to you and so you're like thinking okay well lo you know the logistics what are the logistics of this what are the details of this we need to plan accordingly I can't just accept this offer without thinking about it etc etc wheel of fortune ten of wands six of pentacles yeah I feel like this is coming out of this this offer is like out of the blue I feel that's why the Knight of Wands page of like this fire energy is here. Very sudden. Um, it's like things are set in motion quickly. Things are happening quickly. I think that you were dealing with a lot. Ten of Wands. Maybe you had a lot on your plate. A lot to think about. A lot of responsibilities. Juggling a lot. But this opportunity is kind of like being handed to you. 
and it's like handed it, I don't know like uh, like 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 it was brought to you on a silver platter tell me about this five of wands and the hermit tell me about the five of wands and the hermit Page of Swords, Four of Wands, okay. I feel like whoever this is, they're watching, observing. They could be living with you, like in your home. Yeah, Ten of Wands with Justice, Libra Energy. This could be um, your place of employment, right? That's putting a lot of things on your plate, overwhelming you. Can I get one more, please, for this Five of Wands and the Hermit? If this is a partner. Yeah, you're keeping it to yourself. You don't want to tell them the High Priestess and the Five of Swords. Maybe because if you tell them, they'll fire you, right? Like if you tell someone that you're already looking for a job or that you're interviewing for other jobs, they might just fire you on the spot, right? Right? If you put in your two weeks notice, they might fire you on the spot as well. So it's like you, you're biding your time and you're playing your cards right here. Others of you, if this is like a partnership, like let's say that someone's giving you an offer, a romantic offer that you really, really wanted, this could be a friend, a family member, an ex, someone that would not be happy to hear this. And so you're not, you're not advertising this. This is if Pentacles could even be a proposal, um, you know, something big. And I feel like you're still keeping it quiet. Maybe because your family would get involved or maybe because it would cause drama or you, you just know that there's jealous people, you know, jealous observers that are a little too involved with your life here. And it's much easier to keep this to yourself. Can you tell me more about the energies surrounding Virgo? The second half of May here, Spirit. For Virgo. What are the energies surrounding Virgo? What are the energies? Main female? What are the energies surrounding Virgo at this time? Concern. Okay, so th this could be a fem feminine energy. I cannot talk ever since I started this reading. <laughs> This could be a feminine energy that is too concerned over you. Someone's like, it's like the wrong people are paying attention or um, I, I'm getting the sense of someone that's like a mosquito buzzing around, you know, it's almost like there's someone around you that is concerned over your life, but they shouldn't be. I'm also getting for some of you, you have like a, f a feminine supervisor, boss, um, and they're concerned that you might leave, that you might be overworked, that you might be overwhelmed, that you might just pick up and go somewhere else. Interesting. Tell me about Virgo's energy. Tell me about Virgo's energy, please. What is Virgo's energy? False person. You're hiding this from others, what you've been working on, what you've been manifesting, what you have planned for your future. Tell me about this person that Virgo is dealing with. What do you need to know for this other person? Imprisonment and courtship with mature women at the bottom of the deck. I feel like there's someone else. It's like they don't want you to accept this offer, whether it's a job offer, whether it's a romantic offer, someone doesn't want you to have it. I don't know if it's because of jealousy or control, but they don't want you to have this. Even though this is exactly what you deserve or what you've worked for. And so that's why you're keeping it quiet. Let me know if this is resonating for you. I feel like this is a very specific reading. Um, but if it resonates for you, Virgo, let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear from you. So I'm going to leave it there. Thank you so much for watching, Virgo. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Hit that like button. Uh, if you did enjoy how I read, subscribe if you haven't already. I'd love to have you. 
Um, thank you so much for everyone that takes the time out of their day to subscribe, to like the videos. It helps me out a lot. And I will be seeing you all in another video very soon. Take care.